Here we are. There's the first one right there. Last drink. All right, there's one more drink after that. But I was able to find the, the, the bottle opener, so we're good to go. Uh, first event uh, of the night is the uh, Cruiserweight Championship from 205 Live. We had Neville going up against Austin Aries. Both of these guys... Well, Neville's probably been in the WrestleMania Battle Royal, but his first ever singles match, probably one of the best things that there is about 205 Live uh, and the Cruiserweight Championship and the Cruiserweight Division. Uh, a guy like Neville being able to find a way to break through. Here he is actually looking like he's a real star in WWE. Austin Aries coming over from uh, TNA as well as his time in Ring of Honor when you know he wanted to leave Ring of Honor and join uh, Tough Enough back in, I believe, 2011. WWE didn't even want him then. USA was trying to get him on the show and he turned down but um you know they have a they have a they have a, they have a match it sucks it's on the pre-show but it looks like they're letting more people into the show than last year um looks like there's not a problem about you know people getting in there the people that i know uh, all seem to be settled down into their seats getting ready for a good night um i can honestly say that the match was good it, it honestly wasn't as good as I, I thought it was going to be i i now that i was looking for more i mean you know both guys did big moves off at the top um, but uh, to me, honestly, when I think about the cruiserweight division, I think about WCW. I think about back in the day, you know, how those used to just make you sit in awe uh, of what these guys are doing in the ring. And I, I don't know if it's because these are sort of, I guess you can say, bigger cruiserweight guys. And, you know, it's not Rey Mysterio and Blitzkrieg and uh, um, La Parka and all those dudes from back there. Maybe I'm holding it to a a height that the WWE doesn't want it to be at. They don't want these guys going out there and stealing the show. It's only the opening of the you know, the pre-show of WrestleMania 33. Um, but uh, I honestly was really surprised. that There was a point when uh, Austin Aries was running the match at the very beginning, and then it seemed like at one point he was knocked out, and Neville had control of it. Austin Aries was able to find the, the fire to come back. Um, he hit a big move off at the top. It looked like he was going to get the three. Neville kicked out. And then before you knew it, I was mid-conversation, and Neville hits the big uh, um, red arrow off of the uh, top rope. And uh, he keeps his championship. Really surprised that they kept the title on him. But uh, it is what it is. It looks like they're getting ready for the Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal. There's a ton of people coming down the ramp right now. God, that ramp is, is freaking huge. Um, so we're having fun here at WrestleMania 33. Check this out with the pre-show, and I'll see you guys in a little bit.